Hey yo guys, Peter again. Welcome to Hobby Must Haves episode number two. What you've got, what I'm showing you guys in front of you is, is a octopus tripod. Basically, if you've never seen one of these, then I'm just going to show you just in a few minutes just how really amazing these are. Basically, I only ordered this just a few weeks ago as the current tripod I'm using right now that the camera is on is really sort of doing my head and the legs falling off, the leg keeps dropping itself back in because it's got the polar legs. But you can see, the reason this is called an octopus sort of tripod is the legs is one option. There we go, just lift off yours. And they completely bend any which way you want. Obviously that's not a perfect angle for sitting the camera on. But like you can see, once the camera focuses, the legs completely bend. So if you wanted to hold it, use it as a sort of selfie, sort of selfie stick even. There you go. It's extremely quick to do. And just simply the legs just bend straight back out. Obviously that isn't perfectly straight out as that leg decides to fall off. You can see basically sort of straight out. Or, oh. sorry, I'm in real trouble with this one at the moment. There we go. Or like I say, if you want to just sort of have this like sort of selfie camera. But like I say, these are absolutely amazing. Except when the leg keeps deciding to come out. As I will just show you right now. Well, just in a moment. But like you can see, with mine, obviously you get the tripod. You get the holder as well for obviously mobile. It is really handy. It's like a selfie camera. It's got a bit that pulls out. So you can clip it nice and easy. It can hold basically every size of phone. You can fully spin 360. You can even just take it off if you want to. Your tri it's on the ball. It's our idea as well. That's my leg falls off again. I need to fix that. <laughs> Sorry guys. And just like every other tripod, it can simply move. And if you need to, you can even just pop it off for storage wise. So then you've just got your legs and Keep your phone attached to that. So anyway guys, I'm just going to switch the camera off and show you how really cool these octopus tripods are if you haven't seen one. So I'll see you in just a second. So okay guys, like I said, I would get this sort of attached up, the octopus tripod, and show you how actually really cool it is. And like you can see, I have it attached currently to a table, uh, not a table, like, sorry, a leg of a chair. And like you can see, it is holding up. Like obviously I'm using my other camera on it. It is holding up in place. Yeah, it's a little bit wobbly and stuff, but like you can see, the whole movable tripod in that. I'll just lift and move my camera around. Now you can see, you just simply wrap the legs around, like, whatever you're needing to wrap it around, like a lamp post, a uh, lamp. Like I say, if you were doing sort of, like I say, like tutorials or that, you can have a lamp sitting behind you, have this attached to the lamp, and the tripod will be able to wrap around it. And also with them having the sort of felt on the legs, it just keeps it in place a lot better. It gives uh, more stick and stability. Cause like, see, it takes a wee bit to move it down. And you can move it into the desired height. And obviously, like I say, this is on a 360 and a sort of bendable axis, if you want to call it that as well, for getting a better angle and stuff. And simply, like I showed you in the beginning, once you're done with it, just simply unhook the legs. You can see it's already ready to go. And hey presto, back to being a camera tripod if you want it that way. Simple enough, simple to do. And all you do is just straighten out your legs. Like I say, these tripods are amazingly, amazingly great. Like I say, I would recommend most people getting an octopus tripod. Even if you just do it for like photography wise, out, like outside of that, it is really handy. You can just attach it around a fence, uh, like say, a, like around a branch of a tree or something, if you're out doing a photography, like outside or that. Or even if you just want to sort of hold on to it for doing, taking photos and stuff. It's really, really handy. Like I say, it all fully tightens up, wrap the legs around stuff, and it can hold basically most mobile phones quite easily. Like I say, you can also get the octopus tripods, obviously, for like cam, like camcorders and stuff like that. I don't know how much in the price range they are. Obviously, you can pick one of these up in the UK for about at least 3.99 off eBay, reasonable price, really great 
product than that. I would highly recommend you guys getting one of these if you do need one, like I said. They are amazing. So, I hope you've enjoyed episode number two of Hobby Must Have, Octopus Tripods. I do, I'm going to say it again, I do recommend getting one of these because it's a really cool tripod and really worth the money, guys. So if you haven't liked this video, please leave a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button for more videos like this in the future, guys. And I will see you next time.